Hello, I hope everybody's doing great. I did get my Mooncat order in the mail. This is my first time ever ordering anything from them. I did partake in that 20% off their whole site. So I got nine polishes and their glass file. Um, I thought I'd wait a bit longer than I normally do um, before I put up the swatch and review video. I felt like, you know, there's, I think there's only one new polish in here. Most of these are old. Nobody's waiting on, you know, my swatch and review for these nail polishes. So I thought I'd give more of a, um, you know, I'll swatch and review all of them, but I'd actually wear a couple of these polishes first just to see if I notice anything different or if there's anything exciting about them that warrants the extra price tag because we do have so many options in the nail polish world. Why spend a little bit more for this company? So I just thought I'd see what all the excitement's about because there are so many people that love this brand. So today we'll do an opening and then in a couple of weeks or so, I'll put out the review. I'm so excited. All right, this is what I'm wearing today. This is by Red Eye Lacquer, it's Wilson. I got it from February Polish Pickup 2024. Look at all those iridescent flakes. All right, now my uh, address is over here on the other side of the box as opposed to on the bottom of the box. So hopefully in my excitement, I don't show you my address. scared I'm gonna put the box back into the <laughs> back into the frame okay let's get into this one first oh I'm excited I'm always excited though anytime I get nail polish in the mail let's see this is a different okay here we go Ooh, look how that opened I wonder if that personal information on there they knew I was filming. All right. All right, well, weirdos, welcome home, it says. Mooncats was made for the others, the mit misfits, and the dreamers. You. Okay, so this order, I did pick up some different types of colors. I have been really wanting to try some not necessarily sheer, but sheer-ish type of colors. I've just been following a couple people on Instagram. When they put on those sheer type, like sheer buildable colors, maybe we want to say, <laughs> they just look so beautiful. So my heart is craving that. So I did pick up a couple, I think maybe just two, I don't know, a couple of colors that I felt like were light, but so this one I think is that one. That's why I bring it up right now. This one is um, Petals for a Narcissist. Oh, well, that's cool. So that the name is on the actual box. Oh, this is funny. For those of you who watch my videos know I don't like purple and it, all of their stuff is green and purple. It looks like Halloween. Okay, let me remember that I'm showing you guys too, not just myself. <laughs> All right. Oh yeah, okay. This is the one. I'll have to post um, her Instagram below. I, I feel like I don't know how to say her name, so I'm not even gonna mess around with it, but I've been following her and she has the most beautiful swatches and she's super nice too. We've um, chatted back and forth just a little bit, but this is, I seen her wear it. So, and she said it's buildable. So I decided to go for it. It's the sale. Let's, you know what? Let's look at their brush too. Ooh, that's a nice brush. Let me show you. Well, you guys probably already know, huh? You probably know way more about it than I do. So this, this cap, I'm super interested in this cap right here because I do hear people say how much they hate this cap. But I feel like 
you know who, I don't really hate people's cap very much, but I have, okay, let's stop talking. Let, <laughs> I could just talk forever. <laughs> let's get into more nail polishes. Nobody cares about the cap right now, huh? Okay, so this one is Flight of the Monarchs. You know who talks about this polish all the time is um, Polished Yogi. Oh, I love her. She's so sweet. And she talks about this polish all the time. And even though I, I think the base of this color might be a little purple, but she says you really just see that orange flash. And that is truly all I'm seeing right here is an orange flash. Wow. That does look cool. So hopefully I can um, get it to build up. It, it seemed like I can. Okay, this is the only new polish that I got like from the new collections, the Sirens collection. It's the Sea Between Us. I, you guys know I love Cuticula and she has so many amazing um, blue flaky nail polish. But I did think that this one was like in between, like a little bit lighter than, than some of the ones I've got from her. Ooh, it's beautiful. And plus, it'd be nice to, um, you know, try out there. I've already have such a strong opinion about what I love about flaky nail polishes. So it'd be nice to try them out. But I still didn't want to waste my money and get something that's super, that's similar to something I already have just to compare. But this one it is really nice. I guess I don't need to open every polish, huh? But <laughs> I feel like that's part of the fun, like looking at it on the, on the stick. All right, so I wonder if this one's gonna have a sh slip, slip sh sheet, a slip sheet in it. <laughs> okay, there's nothing in there. Oh, this is my file. I've had the same file for a super long time. So I thought I'd try their file out. <laughs> Whoa, mine's really old. <laughs> as soon as I felt that, I realized how old mine was. Okay, so it looks like this box has a lot of the um, ones that are like super popular. I have a lot, a lot, can I say it one more time? A lot of blue nail polish. I just place an order from Polish Potion, Potion Polish with like four blue polishes in it. I mean, I did not need another polish, but this one is House of Hades. So how can I place an order from for Mooncat and not get House of Hades? Everybody loves this color. Oh, whoa. It looks quite different than, <laughs> isn't this just what every nail polish obsessed person says? Oh, this is, I don't have anything like this, but it's true. <laughs> Let's open this one too. <laughs> I feel like I see purple back there somewhere. I feel like, are you seeing it? Or you probably already know if you, if you love Mooncat, huh? I definitely see around this uh, rim right here, some purple, but I've never heard anybody say that this was a purple polish okay what's this one this one is bottled rage this one has been like from day one whenever i first got on their website i knew this was going to be a polish i bought if i ever bought from this company which why would i not but i can't remember what the description it had been on my list for so long but it looks like a blackened base with like a burgundy shimmer. If I haven't said this already, burgundy was like my go-to color. I feel like um, whenever we were young, well, a lot of us, whenever, whenever we were young, there's like that go-to nail polish. Mine was because I've always loved dark polish, but not necessarily black. So mine was always like deep, dark burgundies my favorites 
This one is, ooh, like a moth, like a moth to the flame, to a flame. This one, on their website, I was not in to their swatch photos. I seen this swatched multiple times. I've seen multiple people on Instagram and on YouTube swatching this color and it always looked amazing. But then it actually was the opposite on their website for me. I felt like on their website, all I seen was that, um, Ooh, yeah, that's picking up. All, all I could see is like a deep, dark color. But on the swatch photos and like the swatch videos, I feel like I could really see a gray, a gray base. I feel like you could see it right here. But I wasn't seeing that in the photos. But then before I actually made my purchase, I went in to make, sh to like look at the swatch photos again before I bought this because I wasn't liking what I was seeing on their website, which I feel like is what the opposite of what I hear from other people. I've watched other vi videos where people say their swatches are not natural or true to life. Like they were better. And then when they got the nail polish in the mail, it wasn't as good, but I felt like at least for this polish, I feel like all the swatch photos videos were better than what they put on their website. Okay, this was stumped. There's no way, actually, let me see if I can find this really fast. I don't know if I'll be able to. Perfect. I almost didn't order stumped because I have Bigfoot Believes in You from November PP Polish Pickup. And I absolutely love this color. So Stumped was always on, you know, the the list if I was to ever purchase. But then I bought this and I really loved it. But then after I was going in and looking at other swatches and stuff, I'm like, oh my goodness, I have to order this. Let's see, we could put it up. Is this Stumped? What the heck? Can you see this? Does this look... I feel like it is coming off orange to you. In real life, I see gold and green. Hmm. No, in a good way, in a good way, but. Wow, I'm not really, like, on the swatch photos, I see a very um jelly, like a, a dark jelly brown base. I'm, I'm not seeing that in the bottle. So like this one, it has a brown base and you could truly see that, but I'm not seeing no brown base in this, but maybe it just has too much other stuff in there. What is this one? Oh, Fields of Elysium. I thought this was green. I thought this was a sagey green color. It doesn't look that way in the box. Let's see. Oh, it was, I was just getting the, the pinky shimmery. Man, that look. I think I've opened every bottle, huh? <laughs> I can't help it. A gray, sagey green. Mm, this is pretty. Well, in the bottle. Almost anything's pretty in the bottle, huh? Okay, this one's access denied. This was another one. Of course, I'm a green lover. Love dark nail polish. So how could I not get this one? This one has a black base. With, that looks like a super, super dark uh, green Christmas color to me. <laughs> it definitely... <laughs> Is looking Christmassy to me, but like you know, a deep moody Christmas. <laughs> wow, there's just so much. You know, I'm such like a a flaky girl. I love glitter, so all this shimmer. I don't know. I mean, it's beautiful without a doubt. It's beautiful, but I love flakies and glitter. So the shimmer just is, um, I don't know. It's beautiful, but we'll see what I, if I like it on the nail. All right. Well, that's everything that just flew by. Let's, let's put them all together. That's always gratifying, huh? To see all the colors 
next to each other. Ooh, these bottles are gorgeous, without a doubt. They're pretty. I'm pretty excited to play with these lighter colors too. Oh man, they all look good. Everything looks good in the bottle. <laughs> Okay, it's all over. Oh, here's this. Let's see, where, where's their, oh, there's the little green logo right there. All right. All right, guys, I hope that was fun. Sometimes I get pretty excited when I'm opening nail polish and I don't remember what I said. So I hope it was fun. I'll see you again real soon. Bye.